more quickly come up for there now. You can see the Daily Trust newspaper that the next one I hold for hand. Now, something different for the Daily Trust with a twist up. We don't talk about already this morning about population explosion inside the Obodo, Nigeria, and waiting uh, the, the present Minister of Finance been come and talk, although later they say she was taken out of context. Uh, she been talking about controlling childbirth and childbearing inside Obodo, Nigeria. Now, the, the Guatori on top of the Daily Trust newspaper, they say Nigeria worries over population explosion. And you will see graph there 19, uh, from 1955, 1960, 65, every five, five years from 1955 reached 2018. For 1955, what's in the put there now? 41 million people, just about 41 million people. And now in 2018, we get 195 million people. This one we say uh, our population they grow in geometric progression. Mm -hmm. That's what you boy talk about. Mm -hmm. Now make us you could even though the minister of finance say they may quote her out of context. Do you think of course we know say it is important for us to watch our population. But do you think say if they begin put rules say maybe we no born pass maybe two children. You feel say we get the ability to enforce such laws in that That's one too na problem. Mm -hmm. Because not be to promulgate law. Now also to enforce the enforce. laws. But make we look this uh, issues so mm -hmm. You don't talk um, about uh, waiting the plot when everybody see for on top of our television mm. and how we take down rise since the 1950s. What did they cause this rise since the 1950s? And mm. uh, a normal thing because people go born. But maybe we ask ourselves this mentality of ah now God now they give Peking and Peking they come with his own blessing. Exactly. What did Peking go chop? He go God come with them. God go provide them. Now what did they cause us problem with this? We know what make government, they come on the pages of newspaper, they talk. You know, this graph with the plot, a very good thing, you know, because if they show us where we go there in the nearest future, in fact, mm -hmm. some people don't plot graph, look, say, based on the way when things day to day, and the factors when they don't see, if it's consistent and it continue like that, by 2050, Nigeria and Congo go make up 40% of the world's poorest people. Only two countries for the full world, Nigeria and Congo, go make up 40%, you know, say 40 if you get 40 over 100, you pass. Oh. You pass. You not fail, oh. you mm -hmm. pass. Even though not strong, you pass. But you pass. 40% of the world poorest people. Now, by 2050 also, they don't already check up, say, as with a bomb bomb every year, 7 million, 7, at the least, Nigeria, they back to, with their unbeaten now, back to back, just like Asna, the invisible that year, 7 million every year, the least, oh. And some people don't come and say, this country will not get um, uh, healthy or vibrant statistics. Say, people say, now 70 million, they will born, when they just come out the zero for the back. By 2050, we'll go there around 400 million. What do we suppose to get? The national policy. Your national policy, now you supposed to drive agriculture, now you supposed to drive education, now you supposed to drive security, now you supposed to drive housing, now you supposed to drive population control. Hmm. Population will not be batting if you manage your population. Well. Population will not be batting if you convert them to strength. Look India now, look, look China very now. True. And very true. If we be one tenth of India, and we get more people living in extreme poverty than India, when we be one point something billion. In all is a problem, they what will be the national policy on population control. In a national policy, now go show say, okay, oh, from today, oh, see what in Nigeria they target. You know, say going into the elections for 1983, before president, uh, this president Muhammad Buhari won't be military head of state that time. Mm -hmm. Come come out like the Sheikh Shagari. You know, say political parties they campaign say light go day. Yeah, they've been the campaign that time, 1983. Say light go day. Even going into the general election between PDP and SDP for 1993, they see they use light the campaign. They see they use water the campaign. campaign. They see they use housing campaign. We could tell ourselves the truth. Not be the same thing. They campaign for 1999, 2003, 2007, 2011, 2011, 2015, even 2019. Yeah. If care is not taken, now back to back, back to back, we'll see, back to back. We'll see they use road and light and water the toast. Now what do we see they use now? Road light, road light, road light, road light. From 1983 to date, if I do, if my calculation no wrong, now like 35 years, we still they talk about light for them. So most times when we discuss these issues, all of us girls say, ah, God forbid, you know, go apple. There's no God forbidding anything. And Jack Gabriel no go come from heaven, come tell us how to do the right things. Now we go start. You know, so you get one thing where you always they talk, and then they like the quote them anywhere. Say, the best time to plant a tree was 20, 20 years, years ago. ago. The next best time is now. We no plant that tree 20 years ago. Now, why we not see under any shade to sit down now? We know they even they plant them today. So, meaning say in the next 20 even years, we go see they discuss this problem. Yeah, exactly, they don't go see any better. We go walk in stick, they say, no, three, four, yeah, it's a shame. <laughs> it's a big shame. To enjoy more of this, our Ugon Get videos when you just watch, press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.